Hare Krishna. This is Mrinal Ghia for Iskorn in the service of Srila Prabhupada and Guru Maharaj. And the topic is, if both chants few number of rounds and the Kunli doesn't match, will there be some problem awaiting in future? I would say the whole, this whole talk is based on Vedic literature. But this, I want to start from this, there's a very popular saying like, you know, marriages are made in heaven. And Shri Prabhupada, he said like, um, uh, ch chanting 16 rounds of Japa is very important. Being firm in Krishna consciousness is very important because that helps one to get out of the cycle of birth and death. And uh, that is the goal of human life according to Vedic literature. We have to understand very important who are we, what is our relationship with God and uh, why do we serve God. Coming back to the point, Srila Prabhupada, if you'll see like uh, before I come to the main point, Shri, if you'll see like in, uh, in India, marriages are largely based on Kunli Milan and Srila Prabhupada on matchmaking said, better fortune follows the auspicious couple who marries with the blessings of the stars. By living together in harmony, foundation is created and from which the real need of Bhakti Yoga can be pursued in earnest. There is this uh, beautiful, uh, I could say like talk of uh, Kadamakanan Maharaj on this topic and he said what is more important is your chanting. Karma, astrology, it is not so important because if you are fixed in your devotional life, you are there to help each other, you are accepting each other as a devotee, you are uh, understanding the fashion of etiquette properly and you are paying obeisances to each other, then all the bad influences in your chart can be neutralized by the mercy of Sri Krishna. Because Srila Prabhupada says like uh, Krishna can kick millions of Rahus. So what is more important is your devotion, is your chanting. We should fill in our home with lot of Krishna conscious things. We should make a realistic choice. And what is that? How we can make our home holy? By inviting guests, by inviting devotees at home, making lot of prasadam, worshipping deities. And these are like simple practices that we can follow at home. And then our home becomes actually, uh, uh, it's like becomes Krishna consciousness. So this is very important. And it is like, you know, sometimes it does happen like a girl or boy is a devotee and the parents are not into devotional service. So in such circumstances, Srila Prabhupada said, like leave the Kunli Milan on parents and just be, have, have full faith on Krishna that Krishna will get you a decent life partner because he is a supreme controller. And we have to have just faith on him. If like, if you'll see like uh, many marriages like, you know, in this con, they are like, sometimes you see like, you know, they are like, you know, from different parts of the world. How are they going so smoothly? It's just because of being have or having full faith on Krishna. So, of course, like, you know, we have to have uh, full dependence on Krishna. And we should see like, you know, what is the qualification of the decent life partner. It's he should be progressive in devotional life. He should be steady in job, would have a financial support, very sound financial support. And girl should be happy whatever the husband is providing her. And should be, should be an encouragement to each other. That is very important. It's like, so uh, these are the simplest things like, you know, which we have to keep in consideration. And then our devotional life becomes absolutely smooth. And like, you know, sometimes like you see, uh, there are things like, you know, which uh, we are get a lot of thoughts like, you know. So if we have full faith on Krishna, then everything will go fantastic. So what is more important? We, what we see is like, the value of astrology in marriages cannot be underestimated, but it has to be properly utilized. And if it's properly utilized in the service of Lord Krishna 
and guru then our life can become very happy i would like to thank jagannath prabhu and Dudha Amrit Prabhu here, like they are doing such a wonderful service. It's like all the friends, I like you know you, we should be really thankful to them. They are like such doing such a wonderful service, helping the grihasthas, helping um, uh, the all the uh, you know the budding devotees. Because all these topics are mainly for the budding devotees, like those who are interested in Krishna consciousness. And there is so much in Krishna consciousness, but we have to start from somewhere. And these are the simplest way we can follow, we can pick few things like chanting, like reading, we can come to the temple and we can actually start our Krishna conscious life. Because it is not difficult, there are all, it's all simple. Singing, dancing, eating prasad is all simple. We have to start from somewhere and see the difference in your life. I wish everyone Krishna conscious life. Hare Krishna.